There were two tragic deaths last weekend that were connected with this year's Notting Hill Carnival. One victim was a 32-year-old woman, Cher Maximen. She was at Carnival with family and friends, including her three-year-old daughter, and was stabbed on Goulburn Road, squarely within the Carnival route. It seems that she had sought to intervene in a fight. Another victim was Musi Imnatu, 41, a successful chef visiting London from Dubai. He was found unconscious with a head injury outside a restaurant on Queensway on Bank Holiday Monday. This was after Carnival had officially ended and away from the route. Overall, there have been eight deaths connected with Notting Hill Carnival since 1987. Each has been a terrible tragedy. Quite correctly, all of these deaths have led to consideration of how Carnival could be better managed and made safer. But they have also triggered calls from right-wing commentators for it to be closed down. This year has been no different. The descriptions of Carnival by these commentators are enough to chill the blood. One talked of guns, drugs, gang violence, vandalism, sexual assaults, half-naked people rutting in the street and stairwells. If you had never been to Carnival and read this stuff, you might well think it should be closed down.